Hello and welcome to my channel. I am your host, Bini Blanco. Hey, Texas Chainsaw. Anyway, uh, di ko alam kung bakit siya naging part ng Asylum. Uh, I'm using Linux Mint nga pala. And meron silang software dyan called Hypnotics. Kung saan nakakakuha siya ng mga free TV. Bukod sa YouTube, eh, ito yung madalas na gamit ko kapag wala akong napapanood na iba. Uh, just to build upon expats that weird night review. <laughs> Evolution. Ayan, <laughs> kumari walang nangyari. Kumari walang edit-edit na nangyari. I think this is better. I'm gonna review some movies and series that I watched these past three months. And, uh, let's start with uh, season two. It's great. Kaso na spoil na ako. Duplicate, major graphic, pero alam ko na rin yung mga yare. Shrinking Ray was difficult, pero hindi siya as shocking as duplicate. Minor gripe lang yun na hindi ako as attached as other people pagdating sa Invincible series. Anyway, all in all, maganda. Maganda yung series na yun. Maganda yun. Kung mahilig ka sa gore, mahilig ka sa uh, animation, maganda yun. Argyle, uh, ginawa pala to noong pandemic. So, nabasa ko yung article na yun na may mga reshoots ba na nangyari so naisip ko na uh, disjointed yung movie na to Argal, I enjoyed kasi uh, it's action comedy tapos yung spoilers again, <laughs> yung spoilers na lalabas si uh, ay si Argyle pala eh totoong agent na galing sa Kingsman or part siya ng Kingsman uh, series, yun, na, na surprise ako doon. So, yun, Argyle, maganda. Ah, Players. Players is... Uh, eh, meh. Sayang si Lucifer dito. Ah, isa pa Lift. So, intolerable, I guess. Tolerable si Kevin Hart dito. Kasi diyang kung usapang style lang, meron naman tong style sa diyang wala eh. Alam mo yun? <laughs> sa diyang may. Magandang pamatay oras lang. Yun na lang masasabi ko. Instant Daddy, yung si uh, pangalan ito? Si Gerald Napoles. Maganda siya. Medyo mishandled yung uh, moments leading up to again another spoilers leading up to the death the death scene is fine nung nakarating sila sa magic island maganda yun but before that scene medyo kinukulangan ako sa parang hirap na parang nararamdaman ni Gerald Napoles it's fine it's an adaptation and they did well Mr. and Mrs. Smith, season 1. It's... It's down. Kahit gusto ko yung actors. But, I guess, ang approach nila dito eh, miniseries. So, as a miniseries, fake, uh, two secret agents na nagpapanggap na, mag, na couple. So, with that in mind, approaching, um, Approaching Mr. and Mrs. Smith, not from the movie, but just as it is, and look at it as an exploration of the characters. Maganda, pero I'd rather watch the movie. So, which brings me to you. I think, to ba na sa hypnotics yun? Uh, maganda to. Uh, puro siya very. I guess we can call this very tell, don't show itong uh, movie na to. But 
the way they approach na parang broken sila and yung both ebb and flow will they won't they aspect ng isang rom-com eh handled well so yan maganda rin siya sa akin underdogs uh, ito surprising sa akin to maganda siya and it's a true story yung black culture na hindi naman ako ganun ka familiar eh medyo prominent dito tapos na kahit nakakatuwa yung mga bata I don't know it's a corporate mandated movie pero ayun nga true story yung underdogs na yun or rather based on a true story Echo Echo season 1 dito hindi sa parang nagmamayabang ha pero dito ko nakita na it's edited down na to, to the point na incoherent na yung script and incoherent na lahat but uh, Echo worked for me sadyang kailangan lang talaga nito mag fit sa daredevil mythos kaya, pa, kaya ito nag elevate lalo sa mata ng ibang marble heads but Echo as it stands pwede mo nang iwan si uh, Maya dito sa uh, part na to ng, ng story niya pahingahin mo muna siya and it's gonna work just focus on the daredevil side of things on making Maya a better side character na may mga random vigilante acts siya na hindi na natin makikita <laughs> The Wisher The Wisher sa... Oh, di na pala gumagana to Eh, di mo pinapansin yun eh uh, The Wisher is a bad movie <laughs> So, it's a... Uh... It's a movie within a movie. It's a slasher, I guess. You can call it a slasher. And, I don't know. If I wished something na specifically to kill someone, mangyayari yun sa movie. So, kung nung na-figure out ng characters yun, bakit hindi nila tayo mag-wish ng pera, ng world peace or something? But, uh, yeah. Ang weird, ang weird nung kung sino yung killer reveal. Ang weird. <laughs> It's a bad movie. Okay, with Damsel. Damsel is... Meh. Yeah, I guess Damsel half expected na nang, nung na-introduce yung dragon and the dragon's gonna burn anyone who comes inside the cave it's already expected na Robin Wright and the prince and anyone any royalty yun yung ending nila na sila yung susunugin so I kinda saw that a mile away but maganda maganda pa rin naman sadyang Millie Bobby Brown hindi mo na matanggal sa kanya yung oh 11 it's 11 so hindi mo na siya parang, ah, kaya niya <laughs> Kasi, malakas overpowered si Eleven sa Stranger Things eh. So, I don't know. Baga wala yung thrill, wala yung hype niya. And that's it. Yun na yung mga napanood ko these past three months. And, kung nagustuhan mo itong uh, video, like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one. Baba naman. Kanap, di siya pante yun. No? Daming kalat ng ano. Ibon. But, ah, uh, yeah. Testing again.